guys I hope you are having a awesome day and I am back at you again with another DIY project now this one is a card box I think the last time I did a DIY card box was probably about a year and a half ago so this one is a little different it's a little bit different from the one I initially did and I wanted to kind of revisit it um, and I think this came out really, really awesome. This is like 90% Dollar Tree items here. So it's five 8 by 10 Dollar Tree frames. And I also added some silver and white a Dollar Tree ribbon to it uh, just to give it a nice little look. And you are absolutely going to love this. This came out really, really amazing. Um, I added some craft paper to the bottom. And that just gives it a little bit of glimmer in the bottom. And then as you can see, you have a nice wide area here. And you could put in multiple cards at one time. Then I added some adhesive lettering on here. And that is from Hobby Lobby. And of course, all of the supplies will be listed in the uh, description box below. And then to add a really nice luxe factor to this card box, um, I added some brooches. And I got the brooches courtesy of totallydazzled.com they really have some beautiful awesome stuff ladies so if you're looking for brooches and different things to accent some of your special event pieces please go check them out they're always having sales 40% off 50% off um, they have easy ways for you to pay they um, utilize after pay so you can make four payments if you decide to buy a bunch of brooches at one time so um, she really has a lot of amazing inventory so go check out uh, totallydazzle.com so yeah I think this came out absolutely gorgeous I am in love with it totally totally in love with it I had a silver gift box but I did not have a white one I think this came out elegant. It has all the right touches to it. It's not overdone. It is elegant and classy and beautiful. You guys are going to love this once it is completed. You will absolutely, absolutely love this box. This is definitely going into my special events inventory because it came out so beautiful. Like, I'm definitely keeping this, okay? I'm not going to dismantle this project. I'm keeping it. All right, guys, so I think I talked a little bit too much. Um, there's not going to be any, um, I'm not going to talk through the tutorial in this video. I'm just going to pretty much just fast forward through it. And I will have some text instructions on there. But um, just to keep the video um, under, hopefully it's under 15 minutes, um, I sped everything up. But I think you'll be able to get through it just fine. All right, so let's get into this tutorial, okay?
Okay, guys, so our project is completed. Um, this came out really great. I love it. It's beautiful. It has just the right bling to it. It's not overdone. Um, it's very simple, but classy at the same time. And then, of course, I brought in those really nice elements um, in terms of adding the brooch and um, everything else, the little bit of glam that it needed. Uh, I put it in just the right places and I think this is absolutely gorgeous. Like I said, it's a, not an overdone card box. It's perfect. And as you can see, that is our beautiful bling right in the front. And then the card lettering is from Hobby Lobby that was on clearance. This is where you actually put your cards right here. I have some glitter paper inside so it looks really, really good in there. And yeah, so that's it. That's our entire um, clear, transparent card box. I think this looks absolutely amazing. And then of course, when you wanna get the cards out, you just take the foam board off on the bottom. Okay, you just kind of peel that tape back and take the cards out. And then you can always reapply the tape again if you plan on using this again. So this is phenomenal. I love it. I hope you guys enjoyed this project. And as always, don't forget to rate and subscribe. Um, also, don't forget to hit the notification bell if you have not done so. So you are aware of when I upload new videos. And check me out on social media, of course. Okay, all the links are um, on the main page. All right, guys. So I will see you in the next DIY video. Take care. Bye-bye.